welcome to our first ever, ever bike tour of Alameda Point. We are very excited um, to give you a people's eye view of the vast scale out here. We are now in a real push to approve some final planning documents for the base in January 2014. And we felt it was really necessary to bring out the city council, the planning board, the community to actually get a a chance to touch and feel Alameda Point, see the scale of it, see the context. When we're talking about some of these things, they sometimes sound very theoretical, and to try to understand them in their context, we thought would be really helpful for everybody. So that's kind of the big purpose of what we're doing today. clinic, about 160,000 square feet, and then a, a 70 acre columbarium, which is just an above ground cemetery. And that essentially the, will be a road that kind of comes through, actually I think it comes through West Red Line and then heads out right north of that hangar out to the VA project. That would be much more passive open space, trails, wetlands, things like that. It would be a bay trail that would go along the, the northern edge and then come a loop that would come back around along the Northwest Territories. They're also proposing a loop around the entire federal property and the VA has given us kind of tentative approval for to have a license to use on their property uh, to the extent that we can get funding for, for that trail. That trail is more constricted. All of this area here is constricted a little bit by the fact that we have an endangered species that nests on the runways on the VA property. We have water, apples dipped in honey, and passion fruit all grown out here for you to try out. over time to the extent that it's providing wetland habitat and, and part of our plans call for potentially even putting adaptive wetlands into the seaplane lagoon to the extent Thank you. 